This is the first of our informed search methods, which is greedy best first search or just greedy search. This is the map of Romania again, except this time, as well as being told the length of each road, we are also told the straight line distance from each of these towns to the goal, which is Bucharest. Whereas breadth first and uniform cost search expanded equally in all directions, we now want to use this distance information to try to concentrate the search on nodes which we think are leading us closer to the goal. So if we have a choice between these three cities, we may choose to expand Sibiu on the basis that its distance to the goal is the shortest of the three. This method is known as greedy search because it tries to get as close as it can to the goal as quickly as possible. Now we have a choice of five cities, and the closest one is Fagoras. Now we again have a choice of five cities, including Bucharest, whose distance to the goal is zero, because it is the goal. So it gets selected next, and the algorithm terminates. Greedy search is not guaranteed to finish quickly, but in practice it often does find a path quite quickly, but it's not the shortest path. The reason it's called greedy search is because it tries to bite off the biggest chunk of the problem that it can in one bite. So it's like those experiments where children are offered the choice between two marshmallows now, or one marshmallow now, and two more later on. Rimniku Vilsia would be a better choice because although the distance to the goal is greater, the path length from the start node is shorter than it is for Fagadas. And when you add the two together, you get a shorter path overall. So next we'll be looking at a star search which tries to combine these two factors and make a better choice of which node to expand.